Good morning guys. I came out early this morning to Lake Calhoun. I was going to shoot some time lapse because it's been super windy and the clouds have just been like whipping across the sky and so I thought it'd be a great opportunity to get a time lapse with great cloud movement and so I jumped out of my car, got my tripod set up, set up my camera, started taking my time lapse and then my tripod fell over and luckily the only thing to break was my lens filter um, on my camera and so I'm not gonna do that today and so I'm just gonna get started with the rest of my day but I want to invite you guys to come along with me today This time lapse isn't gonna turn out as cool as the original one I was gonna do, but at least I'm still getting a time lapse. So take this time lapse of this water tower, clouds moving behind it. It is so windy, I hope the car's not shaking too much. I'm actually shooting through the windshield so that the camera can stay in the car, protected from the wind. We'll see how it goes. It's been a couple months. But today, I finally made it back to the gym. I ran a mile on treadmill, lifted some weights. Feel okay, I don't really miss the gym. It's kind of hard to stay motivated to go regularly, but I think I need it. With using HelloFresh, I've been eating healthier, so I've been feeling like I have more energy. I feel like going to the gym should be the next logical step. I did it today. I think, I'm gonna, I think my goal is to do three times a week, just like we're doing HelloFresh, three healthy meals every week. I wanna hit the gym three times every week. Uh, that's the goal, we'll see how it goes. Now, headed back to the coffee shop, gonna get my morning coffee, gonna do a little work there. At the coffee shop with Kelsey, Jordan, Zach is back over there. We got a new coffee in. We're roasting some Peru today. Super excited to try it. made it home sitting here with trolley she's such a lap kitten always needs to be in my lap when we get home that coffee we had earlier was actually really good the first batch we made was awesome and so I think that's what we're gonna stick with I can't wait for you to try it trolley what are you doing such an annoying cat oh it's been a long day today I frustrating morning I went into the coffee shop early this morning to drop Kelsey off so I could go to the gym, something I haven't done in a long time. And as we were driving past the lake, I saw the clouds moving through the sky because it was so windy. And I thought, what a great opportunity to shoot a time lapse, to get those clouds just moving through the sky really quick and easy. And so I hurried out to the lake. I set up my camera, got the perfect shot in between two trees with downtown Minneapolis across the lake and set it up, hit start on my time lapse, turned to walk back to my car to stay warm, and when I turned back around, my camera had fallen over, and it actually broke the UV filter that was on the end of my lens, which is part of the reason I had the UV filter in the first place, so it did its job, but still kind of a bummer. Then I went to the gym, and while I was at the gym, I set up my camera to shoot another time lapse. It was gonna be a half an hour long time lapse, and when I got back to check on it, for some reason it just stopped and it didn't save and my time lapse didn't work. So second fail of the day. Uh, third fail of the day, I went to fill up the car and then all of a sudden 
uh, my battery just chose to not work. So that was fun. So after all those frustrations, I got my battery checked, charged, drove back to the coffee shop, got to the coffee shop, pulled my backpack out of the car, and I had left the site open, and a bunch of my lenses and batteries fell out and rolled underneath the car. And I had to sit there and reach under the car and fish them out. So after all that happened, I get into the coffee shop and Kelsey starts asking me questions. And uh, like a jerk that I am sometimes, I responded poorly. Uh, I was frustrated. I responded in a frustrated tone. And it's pretty great that she is a better person than me. <laughs> that she, uh, she forgives, that she understands that I'm not perfect, that she... Uh, will allow is not the right word, but she'll deal with um, my frustrations in moments like that. It was a frustrating day, but to, again, to have someone on your team uh, that can work through you with the frustrations um, is a pretty big deal. And so props, props to my wife.